All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another PGA Tour 2K23 video. Today, Matthew Fitzpatrick has been added to the game. As you can see, he has 72 power, 82 putt weight, 87 putt path, 68 lie range, 66 shaping, 80 transition, 69 swing path, and 77 timing. And there you can see, turn pro in 2014, five foot, 10 inches tall, and he's right-handed. So yeah, he looks a bit like Casper the Ghost, but he does kind of look like that in real life as well, to be fair. We're gonna play the new MasterCard Mountain Valley CC course. So we're playing the new course with the new playable pro. So awesome that they finally added in a new playable pro. Uh, good to have Matt Fitzpatrick in the game. He's an awesome dude and uh, a major champion at that. So let's see what he's like in the game. Because when you're off the tee driving with these guys and they have their different swings, it definitely does change the, the tempo and how far you have to bring the club back and stuff like that. So we'll see Matthew Fitzpatrick's smooth swing here and now. Ma uh, MasterCard Mountain. This course is cool. I did play a little bit of it. I haven't done a full 18 on this course yet, I think. I played a little bit of it, but uh, not a whole shebang. Matthew Fitzpatrick, that is quick. That's because I know why it's quick, though. Because I have the wrong preset on... Well, that's fine. 316, 317 it's yards it. there with Matthew Fitzpatrick. Not bad, brother. Not bad. 95 yards out from here. All right. I think this should be the club, honestly. So Matthew Fitzpatrick, 7 iron, 181 yards. Pretty similar to myself, honestly. Tiny bit slow, but that should be A-OK. -okay. Might just slip off to the right a little bit here. Unless it catches this little hill that sends it left. No, it's going the opposite way. And that might be off the green here, I think, unfortunately. Hard to tell with the shadows where the green ends there, but that's pretty much where there. We're yeah, off the green and we're chipping. Word. Is he picking up his divot? No, he is walking off into the trees. All right, Matthew. No worries, lad. Shot. We'll chip it in. We'll chip it in with Matty Fitz. Ooh. Big fast, but not terrible. No, it's not great, actually. Pretty poor chip. I should have put a lot of spin on that. These greens are quick. Here is a these greens on footer. default are 172. So that'll tell you these are these are no joke. These greens. And have one? I held it? No, I haven't. Wow. Oh my goodness. Shocking start with Matthew Fitzpatrick. He's trash. <laughs> He's bad. Matthew Fitzpatrick. Bogey on the first. All right, let's get it back. All good. This course is tough, but um, there's some scorable holes for sure. And there's a lot of hills like this as well, like backstops and stuff, which I love. All right, a little bit of a high draw here. Beautiful swing. Oh, beautiful golf shot. Beautiful golf shot. High draw to perfection. Played to perfection. Yes, sir. All right, 178. Great work there. There we That's go. A great approach. Okay, good luck. Seven feet to go. And we bounce back. That didn't turn oh, at all great. then. And it even pulled it. How did that not turn at all? Here we go. Wow. What was that, boys? Good. That's shocking. That's I can't believe that didn't turn at all. Guys, if you want 20% off Rogue Energy, by the way, they have new flavors, and you can use my code, the Apex Sound, to get 20% off. Uh, I am actually mixing Rainbow Candy with Rocket Pop for the first time today, and it's a really good mixture. Um, I think Rainbow Candy and Strawberry Bubblegum are going to mix well with pretty much everything. Ooh, That's a big up. fast right there. My tempo's ass right now. Matthew Fitzpatrick, his tempo's not good. I'm blaming him anyway. <laughs> Not really his fault, but I'm blaming him. And that is into the heavy rough. That's going to be a layup. Of course it's on the par five and a reachable one at that. So no surprises there. Swing plane, tempo, all a little off here, to be honest. Matthew Fitzpatrick, you're letting me down here, buddy. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, but this is clearly your fault. I don't know who else's fault it could potentially be, but definitely not mine. All right, let's go for this. A little, little bit of loft, nothing crazy. Uphill, so I'll put a little bit of loft in spin, but... And a slow there should actually pr be pretty good. This might bounce too hard, though, is the only thing. Sit. All right, that's a good shot. Could be a chance for our first birdie of the day. On the par five here, Matthew Fitzpatrick looking good. Oh, it's getting there. Yeah. Oh! oh Okay. What was well, that? Now what was that? Sitting at one, over one of the most round. horrendous bloody bounces I've and ever seen. See how things go here on the floor. Lip outs rather, not bounces. There we that go. That's more like it, Matty. That's more good. like it, Matty. Big, big, big D loft. Big fade. Perfect drive. 
Bombs away. That should be a little pitch or a flop from there, honestly. Matthew Fitzpatrick and his caddy discussing what's going on there. And what do I do here? Gonna hit a little 46 yard one. Beautiful. Beautiful flop. Really good flop. Sit now. Oh, yes. That's gonna be a birdie. That's gonna be our first birdie. It should have been our first birdie on the last hole, but we'll take it on this one. We'll take it on this one. Back to level par. I want to finish this round deep under par here, all right? That's the goal. Here comes That's the goal, all right? All right, Maddie, what do you got? Ooh, big slow. Big slow, but there's lots of fairway out there. There should be A-OK. -okay. I just realized I have true shot and stuff on because I was recording for a, for a video. Um, but I should have that turned off, really. Here's our I can probably turn it off from here, hole. to be honest. A little gap wedge, a little 136 gap gap wedge. Okay, you got you got bombs with the wedges, Matty. I see you. Big slow, but I also kind of pulled it. That might not be too bad if this kicks left a little bit, which I think it should. Yeah. All right, we'll take that. Good chance for back-to-back -back birdies. Real nice well, chance for back-to-back -back birdies. Fitzpatrick likes the look of it anyway. Right, this putt for the but you're going to have to make a birdie, Fitzy. Because I can't be having any of this level par stuff. We need to be under par. And now we are. Matthew Fitzpatrick back to back birdies to get to one under, son. Let's go. Let's go, Matthew, lads. He looks happy about it. He looks smug about it. At one under par. A little bit fast, a little bit pulled. But not the end of the world, I suppose. Kick. 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 Yes. Yes. It's fine now. And this is about it's fine now. Yards or so and this should be the perfect the club here, you know. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Couldn't be any better. Couldn't be any better. It might need to roll out a little bit here, but the greens are quick. So I think it shall. All right, not quite as much as we would have wanted. Did have a little bit of loft and spin on it. Safe but approach, a good nice. shot nonetheless and a good chance for three for straight five. birdies here. Let's see if Matthew Fitzpatrick is up to the task of three straight birdies. I don't think I've hit it hard Going enough. No, I haven't. Hole. Not on that line, at least. Not on that line. Needed a little more break. A bit too much power into that putt. All right. All good, though. Good so far. All gravy in the Navy for a little Matty Fitz. On. It's a par. Steadies the ship. One under through, through six holes. We'll try and be uh, two, three under through the front nine. Three under would be Stay nice. At minus one he's actually he's hour. actually sponsored by 2K you now in real life as well, which is uh, which is dope as hell. So they really have to get him in the game. Would have been weird if he wasn't. My little voice crack. Beautiful swing. Perfect shot. I know that's a tiny bit slow, but should be just a okay. This might actually kick hard. Is the only thing. Stay there. Stay there, please. No. A little unlucky to roll out that much. I mean, I did have a decent amount okay. of spin on it, but Could be a birdie on the scorecard 48 foot by is a little harsh, I feel like. Now, Fitzpatrick, do you want to hold a 48 footer? I've seen Looking you hold putts like nice. this uh, ah, to win a major, but not quite on this Maybe occasion. Four foot path. Not quite. Done. We're in there. All right. The par. Another par, but a par five to come. Matthew Fitzpatrick ain't short as well. You know, he's he's right bombing the ball 300 yards. He can still play. He can still hit the ball a long way down there. A little bit slow, but should be absolutely splendid. And that is the perfect opportunity to go at this green in two. Um, even with the 600 yard par five, I still think we'll be able to uh, to get this on in two because. Uh, it runs along down there. We might have to play it in from from left to right a little bit. Okay, second shot here on the eighth hole. But yeah, we should be able to make this. I think. To be honest. Oh, I don't know. Can make it down there, you know. Hmm. Well, if you hit it slow like that, you won't, and that's going to be an awkward little bunker shot from down there. Poor golf shot, really. I couldn't have even gave that the opportunity. Fast would have been better, but okay. Out of the green side, bunker. all right. Let's no problem. Nice up and down and ski daddle. Get in. Oh, hit the rough beautifully. Just gonna travel a little bit past it, unfortunately. Would have been good if it went up that backstop and came back a little bit, but we'll take it. Matthew Fitzpatrick likes it anyway. He's giving a, a little nod and a smile, and we still have a good chance for a birdie here. 
It breaks hard at the start, but then it breaks pretty much back to the right the whole way after that. Perfect putt. Right in the heart of it. And that's a birdie to get to two on the par for Matthew Fitzpatrick. Let's go, lads. Let's go, lads. Sketchers and 2K. All right. All right, Matthew. I see you. Oh, big fast. You know what? That... If, no, it's not going to reach. <laughs> I was going to say that might actually be okay, but not quite going to reach, unfortunately. That's going to be a tough one from there. Something it's going to be reachable still, no doubt, but it's a short one, but it's going to be awkward for sure. We might have to try and potentially use this backstop here is the thing, but it's going to be very difficult to do so. A little fat. That could work. Don't hit the downslope, hit the flat of it. Yep. That could work real nice, because it's going to go up and come back down a little bit, I think. Come on, come back down. Come back down a little bit. Oh, that's a great shot. That's a great shot. It's kind of going more left than back, because it was a little bit left of where I was aiming, just because of the fast. But, nonetheless, very good shot and a very good chance for Birdie here to get to three under on the front nine. That would be a really solid front nine here at this course, because as I said, it is a difficult course. Um, and we've nailed it. We've nailed it right into the middle of the hole with Matthew Fitzpatrick. Three under, front nine, 33. And we'll try and have an even lower back nine. Matthew Fitzpatrick, little smile to the crowd. And we'll see if we can uh, go even lower on the back nine. All right. That's the goal, at least. Good drive. That's more like it now. That's more like it now. I found my rhythm, found my tempo, and Matthew Fitzpatrick has found his as well. We found it together, me and Matty boy. That's a 335 yard bomb. Leaves us a pitch in. Should be perfect with the with the uphill nature of this shot. This should just be absolutely bloody ideal. If I didn't hit it fast, it would be ideal. But unfortunately I did, and that's going to be quite tough now. That's gonna be quite tough. 91 yards. Alright, no worries. Lining up for the 13 foot putt. Hmm. Didn't hit it. Oh, wow, I just didn't hit it. Did I? Oh, I did. I did! <laughs> I thought I didn't hit it. Three birdies in a row this time for the first time in the round. Matthew Fitzpatrick has caught fire. He bogeyed the first, but he's battling back since. He's four under par now. Here we go. Time to kick it off on the 11th hole. Slow. Should be fine, though. I think this is going to catch a piece of the fairway and bound away down there. And be pitched, maybe even flop range. No, I think it's definitely going to be flop. It might even be a full wedge, actually. Full lob wedge, potentially. Yep, exactly. Full what? <laughs> full lob wedge distance. Oh, well, Matthew Fitzpatrick lob wedge is a bit more than my own now. So I think a pitch might suit this better for, for Matty Fitz. 89 yards down the hill. See? Oh, yes, Matthew. Oh, this could be good. oh yes, Matthew. That's a gorgeous golf shot. Stops it up nicely, and that is going to be four straight birdies to get to five under par through 11 holes. And I said we wanted to go lower on the back nine, and we're doing just that. We're doing just that already. It's a perfect start. I think Fitzpatrick's a sandwich here. Maybe not the sandwich. I'm going to loft this rather than try and hit that one a little bit, and we're going to put a little spin, and that should be absolutely bloody ideal now. Go up that hill. Go up that hill and come back down. Go up that hill and come back down there. No. Damn it. It is going to come back down a little bit, but I was hoping for it to go up really further and come back down well to the left a bit as well. This leaves us a tricky putt for five in a row, All right, here we but go. Fitzpatrick is usually up to the challenge with the flat stick in his hands. That one's just going to miss left, though, uh, unfortunately. Good effort. At the right pace, just a little bit Four on the low point. side. This putt's tracking. All right. Yeah, Ain't no problem. Ain't no problem for me, son. Let's see what happens here. We got a long par four for this. Three oh three shouldn't reach the end, but I'm just gonna put a little bit of spin and a little bit of deal off just in case and hit it ninety eight percent. Perfect drive. That still might reach the end. Reach the end. Honestly, I should have put a. No, that's gonna be ideal. That's gonna be bloody ideal. What a shot, Fitzy. What a shot, lad. 331. I really liked his episode yeah, in Full Swing as well, actually, guys. I don't know if you guys watched Full Swing, but great uh, great episode on Matty Fitz when he won the Open. His family seemed really cool and genuine, and he just seems like a really nice guy. Uh, couldn't have happened to a better person there winning a, winning a major championship like that. Um, but... Oh, I hit it slow. Was it the US Open, rather? Um, good shot there. Good shot there. Like we'll that, take that, baby. 
Here we go. For this is birdie. another chance, another good chance to get to the six under. Back to back chances to get to six under, and we've squandered them both. No, that was a poor no putt, though. Five. The other one was a good effort. That was a poor effort. Swing plane was off, and That's I definitely hit that feet. too hard, taking the break completely out of it. Going. But a par nonetheless. Par on down. both nonetheless. And five holes left. Let's see if we can get to eight under. I think eight under is a good target with five holes left. Birdie three of the five, and we'll be on our bike. Right, tough par four here, though. It's a tough finish to the scores because this is a 530 yard par four, by the way. Like, I mean, that is just ridiculously clean. difficult. And I found the center of the bunker. That's going to be a layup. It's going to be a layup on a par four. It's been a long time since I've said something like that. That is going to be a disgusting layup right, on a par four. Unless same. I could potentially hit the shot of my life with a three wood here. And I mean, truly a spectacular golf shot. Now, I can't see if that's actually going to go through that or not. Is that going to hit the sand or not? Like, I can't tell. It's going to be close. It's going to be on the edge, but sometimes you got to YOLO it. Ruh -ruh. And hit it. <laughs> it definitely hit it. At least it got out of the bunker and went forwards. So that's going to be a All right, gonna be an awkward the third shot. But right out of the sand and into the fairway. Good stuff. We're about Beautiful shot. I'm just going to hit this straight up because I think this is going to run up. And I don't want to stop it with spin or anything because I need this to get up that hill. It actually, is not going to get up that hill. I think this is going to come back down, unfortunately. Yeah, uh, that's what I was worried about. But even without the spin, it still came back down. And now this is going to be an this next awkward little birdie putt. Just, just a tad bit tough. And a little bit pulled, but I think that might be to our benefit, to be honest. He's hit oh, it. He's got drop. it. Ooh, that's, that's I forgot this is a par four, so yeah, that is actually a bogey. No, wow, that is a tough par four, four though. Par Bloody hell! Let's see a stick drive messed us here. up Let's badly though. It was a poor drive, no doubt. Ah, you donkey! That's two really poor shots in a row now. Off the tee. That's gonna leave us a really, really difficult pot down the hill and. I actually might not be end up being too bad, you know. The fact that it went so far up the hill, it's coming back down at a rate of 90s. Okay, not terrible. Could be a lot worse, actually. Still going to be a tough putt for a birdie, but it's not actually that bad. I thought this was going to be way further downhill. That's actually a really good shot now. And we've got it. Boom, baby. Bounce back birdie after the bogey there. PBFU with a good kind. Three holes left. We need to birdie them all if we want that eight under target. So I think the eight under target is starting to slip away from us a little bit with Matthew Fitzpatrick, especially considering these last few holes are quite tough. But we can still do it. There's no doubt. We can birdie every hole or even eagle the last potentially if we can't birdie these next two. But I do believe the last is a long one. Can't remember now. I, I don't know if I, I've actually played it, to be honest. <laughs> I don't think I have. I said I hadn't played all the whole of this course, have I? Yeah, I don't think so. All right. Well, we'll see. That's a good shot, though. That gives us a good chance for birdie. Not quite long enough, unfortunately. The slow just takes a little bit of distance off it. Uh, it's going to be a tough putt. It's going to be a tough putt, no doubt. It's Patrick looks, like, disturbingly um, white. His complexion is just a little bit too Caspery-like. Okay, 17 foot... Yes, Maddie. Oh, no. Thought I had it. It was turning in the whole way, and it just stopped right at the Here's end there. Unfortunate. So far, so Unfortunate, good. but a good par. Right. Tough hole. Solid Two part. holes left. Par three, par five. Let's see how we finish. Fitzpatrick, how about a little hole in one? How about a little Maddie magic? Well, this is a ridiculous par three. 326 three yard par three. We're taking the piss here, are we? We are taking the bloody piss. What is that about? Oh my Ooh, god, what a shot, though. Shot Unfortunately, it's going to be too much, no matter what I do here, I feel like. Well, that might actually be the best shot I've ever hit in my life. Matthew Fitzpatrick, hole in one of the century. Oh my god, please hit the pin. I dare you to go in the hole. I dare you to go in! Oh my oh, word! Goodness. Matthew Holy Fitzpatrick! What else can you say? <laughs> His first day in the game, yeah, yeah, and he's just got one of the best hole in ones you'll ever see in your lifetime. A 300 yard par three. And we've got a hole in one. <laughs> you sick, sick man, Matthew. You sick man.
Matthew Fitzpatrick with the best hole in one you'll ever see in your lifetime. We're not even going to see it go in the hole. How long is this? 327 yards, I think it was. 327 yard hole in one. 26. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh my god. That should be a power four, honestly, and we would have had a we'd have had a hole in one and a power four. An ace atros. But nonetheless, I'll take it. <laughs> what a power three. What a way to finish. Jesus Lord. I was saying I need an eagle. I didn't expect it to be on that hole, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> How about we finish back-to-back -back eagles now? Hole in one eagle finish? That would be the way to finish here. That would be some way to finish for Matthew Fitzpatrick, and we'd blow our 800 target out of the water. Yeah, unreal, boys. Absolutely unreal. This is definitely a gettable eagle hole as well, 100%. I cannot believe that just happened. I cannot believe that just happened. That might actually somehow work. That might... It's too far. Way too far. He said the pin as well. How about it? <laughs> Imagine. Imagine that hit the pin as well. Yeah, I should have came a club back to be fair. I was I was lofting it and hitting a fade, which usually brings distance off it, but it was never gonna bring that golf. much distance off it. And that's a 51 foot eagle putt. Eagle. Finish nine under par. Didn't hit it. Straight up did not hit that putt, and that is gonna be short left. But a good uphill putt for an eagle. Or for a birdie rather. That was not short. Not sure. This one's eight. Wasn't hard enough to keep away. that line, but that would have been way past if I. Uh... Looking good. Oh no Ooh. way! <laughs> Who cares? I got the hole in okay. one. Who cares? My eight under target has been. Uh, okay, has been failed, but here. who cares with that hole in one? Yeah, what a one bloody hole in one with this pad, right? Unbelievable stuff. Well, Unbelievable well stuff. The here. best hole in one you'll see in this game so far, I think. I actually genuinely think that is the best hole in one that you'll see from, from anyone. <laughs> from anyone in this game, just because of how perfect it was. It was played to absolute perfection from Matthew Fitzpatrick. What a man. What a video. Thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Make sure to drop a like on the video. It's the best way to let me know you enjoy the content. And we will be back, of course, with more PGA Tour 2K23 videos throughout the week. And I shall see you guys then. It's been my pleasure to serve you all. See you next time. Peace out.